So we're uh, Webheads in Action, uh, Talon, the 18th Talon event and the 8th Webheads in Action week weekly meeting. But we missed it yesterday. Nina's just asked what happened yesterday. Uh, I put a, a post out about it. Did you see that? I can put it in the text chat. I think I've got it right here. Here we well, go. Mm -hmm. I didn't see the post until I had tried to get in because I have uh -huh. it as a recurring event on my calendar with the same mm -hmm. link. When I couldn't it's get so in with that link, Zoom was I down to the yeah, IO yeah. group. Yeah. The short answer is Zoom went down. Yes. So and but the thing is, is that I was testing settings the whole, to prevent. The whole thing? Uh, well, the Zoom blog just, says it was. We it says it was. Having a meeting, but then it. What did they say? You couldn't restart it. Could a you? subset. They said it was a subset of Zoom users, and they were no more specific than that. But if you well, look. Well, I'm, I'm actually shocked that it doesn't happen all the time with the scaling up that they've had to do in the pandemic. I'm surprised that it's been so robust. Yeah, here I'll just I'll, I'll show you the post because I can show you quickly some things there. Uh, this is the post. So um, this is uh, there's a uh, this is the Zoom tweet uh, tweet thread uh, telling them telling you that they're investigating the causes. And if you go to that link, which is there, I believe, then. Mm -hmm you can find a whole thread. The first one up in the thread is Vicki Davis. Do you know Vicki Davis? I don't. A yeah, teacher, yeah. She's well known in the United States, K-12. Anyway, if you look, if you go to that link right there, you can find dozens, if not hundreds of people who have complained. And um, so, you know, it was very widespread. But basically, apparently they, they caught it, but there also, uh, there were some other uh, posts that talked about it. So I've got the links there. So uh, it was a great concern to me because I had just made changes to the configurations to keep out Zoom bloggers. And when we all arrived at the meeting, um, uh, no one was able to speak. No one was able to put on a video. Oh no, sorry, we were talking. We were talking to each other. It's actually a yeah, video there. My really video worked. Mm -hmm. But uh, even the waiting room, people would come into the waiting room, I would admit them, and then they would stay in the waiting room. It just said joining, joining, joining. That's what I was talking about. Uh, they Is that were, what happened with me? You admitted me, but then yes. I was never yes. actually admitted. Yes, exactly. I so, so I sent you the, the anguished email because yeah. I thought that you were busy with um, Susan and maybe weren't. No, Susan, Susan couldn't well, get in. Pretty hard to, it's pretty hard to miss it, you know? Um, when I'm hosting, the the person wanting to admit it, they, they show up right smack in the middle of your screen, so it's hard to miss. Yeah, there is a notice, and you can see them up at the top of your participants list, and yeah. normally you can let them in. Uh, but anyway, yesterday, I, I thought it was something I had done with the settings, because it changed so many things. You know, it's like if you want to fix a car, you fix one thing at a time, turn it on, and see what's yeah. working. Uh, if, if you fix, if you just do a lot of adjustments, oh, you're on a mind trip. You'll never know what, what you did. <laughs> right. We could make a lot of different analogies about that. Yes. yes. I, won't get into, I won't get into that. Yeah. Well, basically, I made a lot of changes. And when we came into the room, nothing was working. It was really awful. So I thought it was me. So I went to bed like that. And my wife... And then she wakes up and she checks because we got a grandson and she just checks Facebook. And she found out that Google, that Zoom, sorry, had gone down and uh, oh. it was big news. And she, when I woke up, she said, Pants, it's not you, it's Zoom. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> so it made me feel better. <laughs> speaking of Bobby. Speaking of is. Zoom. Hi, Bobby. Here's Bobby. Hi. Hi <laughs> yeah, she's How are putting you? dinner on the table. Yep, getting it's smelling so good. Nice yeah. to see um, you. Yeah, good to see you too. <laughs> so I was looking at the the document that you posted uh, from Heike, I guess, yeah. about uh -huh. Zoom settings. Yes. Uh -huh. And I was trying to 
follow those guidelines, uh -huh. but I couldn't because what I saw on my list of basic meeting things, the one mm -hmm. that I was looking for, I can't remember what it is anymore. It wasn't there. Let me. So I, couldn't, I couldn't do it. Oh, okay. Could you share it? Because I haven't been looking into it. And I have yeah. some settings also. Well, Vance, if you can bring up the article, I will bring up my my Zoom page. You mean you, you're going to bring up Heike's? Yeah, if you could bring up Heike's article, which uh, I was trying to follow. Yeah, okay. Let me see. I, I, was, I, will, I was trying to... I was trying to find forum on the map. Okay. There anyway. are screenshots. <laughs> That's there. what I did. Okay, so the uh, Heike's article is probably, let's see, I've got so much open here. Let's see, it's probably in, uh, let me just see if, if that's in. Um, maybe I can find it. Maybe I bookmarked it. Yeah. Here, it, here it is. Okay. Yes. Yes. Here it is. It's in this section. Let's see. I just found this um, in uh, in my in the post that I gave you. As, as the nearest thing I could find, really. So if, this is a section in my COVID document which points to Heike's article. That's the. Okay, that's COVID where I got it from. Yeah. Okay, so, so there's a place there that takes you to settings. Yeah, let me show you my settings. In meeting basic. Uh, okay, hang on a minute. Let me pull up my. Oh, no. I, oh, no, I got to share. I'm sharing. Okay, yeah. All right, so let me get my. Oh, cancel that. Okay. Can you see my uh, Zoom? Yes. Okay, yes. so uh, um, there we go. Okay, so this is my profile. Okay, and I don't see the profile. You don't I, see I don't see in the profile. I see the the opening window. Yeah. So join a meeting. Sign in. That's ah, what I see. I've put that away. Oh, well, okay. Hang on a minute. Let me stop the share. I thought I thought I, I could have hit that window by mistake. Um, okay, so let me try I again. I thought that once you're in your browser that you can go from one page to another page while screen sharing. and In your browser, yes. Yeah. Can that you see it now? Yes. yes. Okay, there's my profile. Okay, here's meetings. You've got actually right. meetings and settings. But the right. settings you I want. Settings when I got. The settings are in meetings. When you go to meetings, meetings. Oh. Here, here it is. It's, okay, uh, wait a second. That may be problem you know that i was in the wrong settings maybe not know? let me let me go back well, let me see this is the same settings i was in this is my profile here and if i look so under settings here settings. yeah there are a couple of settings that you know it's the same thing it goes okay. to the same settings okay so most then of there this was a recommend a recommendation for in meeting basic to make a change okay let me scroll down and let me just as I scroll down, I'm just going to see if there's anything you should pay attention to. So um, most of this is having a password and not using your personal ID. Um, require a password and schedule. Okay, so to schedule a meeting, I have to have a password. So um, none of this is important. Uh, require, nope, mute, mute participants on entry. You want to do that. Okay. I don't generally do that. Because most of the meetings that I have are small, kind well, of like is, the WebHeads meeting. It, What's the point of muting people on entry? Uh, because if you don't, then when they come into the meeting, and if they're bombers, or even if they're just rude and impolite, then they'll start, their mics are on, their videos are on. If they're bombers, they may show you something rude, rude on their video. I polite people, Vince. <laughs> well, I only know nice, you, polite people. You mentioned that you were going to do a political uh, thing. Yes, well, that's coming up, and that okay. could be bigger, and that will have people that I don't know. But what concerns me about muting mics, and I might do it for that meeting, 
is that when you have people that are not familiar with Zoom, mm -hmm. um, then you have to deal with the fact that they don't know how to unmute themselves. Yeah. Um, and That's you have true. to. Okay, well, if it, whatever works for you is fine. I mean, everything was working for me until we did uh, uh, Nick Peachy's session and all of a sudden these guys showed up. So uh, That must have been awful. Yeah. So, and this, uh, screen share. How, how do you eject someone into the waiting room? Okay, while I'm on this page, can I, can I, the other thing here is screen sharing. Yeah. Okay. And right. who can share only the host? Okay, so there's, an, there's another place while you're in the meeting that you can also, uh, I, I can make you uh, a co-host. Uh, so, co I'm, so you can see I'm just looking at that. So I have that setting for screen sharing host only. But what if during the meeting I want to ask somebody else to share their screen? Yeah. Okay. Let me show you that. Uh, I'm just trying to come down and oh, oh, this one is very important. If you remove a participant, you don't want them to rejoin. No. So you have to turn right. this off. I think I've got that one. Okay. Oh. There you see yeah, the next that's one. That's turned off. Allow a participant to rename themselves. Yes. Perhaps you should yeah, that's fine. not allow that plans. But if you don't want to allow them, you just turn it off. Yes. I mean, yeah, I don't have a problem. But there, with it's that. also that one, a couple of these. This one, allow remove participants to rejoin. And yeah. um, let's see. Allow I mean, if, if they can't rename themselves, they cannot come in as somebody else. Well, if you if you have a waiting okay. room, then you have to decide whether to let them in or not. And um, if uh, once they're in the room, they can rename themselves. But uh, why? Why would they? Would they? Why would they want to? If they are legitimate persons uh, that were known to to webfellows. Let, let me give you an example. I yeah. had a Zoom meeting yesterday with a small political neighborhood group that yeah. I met and I was the host. And some people came in with... iPhone. Uh, yeah, iPhone, or, or uh -huh. somebody came, came in with their husband's name, which they didn't even share the last name with. And these are people that, you know, they don't all come to the same face-to-face -face meeting, so they don't all know each other, and I wanted their name to be there. So mm -hmm. I explained to them how to rename themselves okay so that the people in the meeting could see who else was in the meeting if they didn't recognize their face yes. did we come on the part in the settings where you can create co-hosts that's no great. i can't find that okay let me go back to my share and i'll see if i can find that i'll be back in one minute yeah okay Suze. Just go ahead. Mm -hmm. Just I, in fact, I don't see anything about host. Okay. In mine. Is, see, you can see my screen. Uh, I'll look at mine, but I will look again at yours. Okay. Here's about the waiting room. Okay. When it, place in the waiting room. You know, I don't have it in here because it's also available when in the middle of a meeting. Um, let's see. I'm looking for. What am I looking for? Uh, make a co-host. Uh, let me see. Where is this? When meetings cancel, maybe I just look up co-host. Oh, how did Here you do that? I just There's did Control F. Control F. Uh -huh, okay. Let me try that. Let me try. Yeah. Whoops. If you're in your settings, you can look up co-host. This is very important. All right. Because. There are many times when you need to allow, like you want someone to do a screen share or whatever. You don't want to give that capability to everyone. If you can make someone else a co-host, then they can, you can give them uh, things that they can do. I'll make you a co-host. But, but in order to do it. that, you have to enable this before you set up. Wait a second. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I'm going back and forth between my settings and your settings. Yeah, this is uh, this this page was in my profile. Uh, where is and it? And now yeah, I totally lost my Zoom screen. Hang on. It's in your profile, which you 
I gotta get the cameras out of the way. Okay, so it's over here. Um, yeah, let's see. This I've is totally this is, lost it. Yes, uh, when, when you I, I can see there's a tiny, there's a tiny little, little screen, screen, but I can't enlarge. Let, let me go get my glasses. Okay, this is Zoom US, and under Zoom US, okay. you have my account. Yeah. I, I think that when you share your screen, we, we cannot go into our personal settings. Okay, like when you go to, you have to go to Zoom US. Can you see that, Zoom US? All right. I, Zoom dot US. All right, are you talking to me or to Suze? So whoever, Suze asked me a question. She said she no, I, 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 I may have lost something uh, while I was away. Well, what you started, are we, what you started are we doing now? Zoom.us. And then you go to your account, which is here. So Zoom.us. And at the top of that page in the right-hand corner, you can see my account. Have you gone there? Can you find that? Not at all. I mean, I'm, did you ask me to, to, to go in my browser? Yeah, in your browser, if you type yes. in zoom.us yes. and then right. find your account in the corner, that's how All you right. get to your settings and your meetings and profile. Okay. okay. Are you there? Are you with us, Nina? No, I don't. Uh, what, I don't what, see, what, I, what are I, you? Usually I don't get to this page, so I don't see where I have to do anything. You open a browser. Yes, and you just type um, in the browser. Okay. I don't know if you can see this, but it's Zoom oh, US. So, so I can sign Zoom in. Zoom.us. US. And when you go there, you come to the page that I'm showing you on yeah. my screen share. And at the top of the right, upper but right I, corner. I, I'm unable to see the screen share on Zoom and having a window open. I, that's, that's really too complicated for me. You can't thing. see the screen share on Zoom. Can you see it, Nina? Or Yeah, I can see okay. it. I, I, Suze, did, did your window suddenly get very small? Mine or? Uh, I already no, have it. I already made because it. What happened to mine? I, I need to have more windows open. So My, my Zoom window yes. went down to like this size. If you can look oh. at my fingers. Okay. Very, you can expand I mean, it. Not see. Yes, but I couldn't see how to expand it. It was so yeah. small. So yeah. that's why oh. I have to get my I glasses. Think it's a, Go to you can toggle between full view, full screen, or some reduced screens. You can toggle back and forth. Yeah, but this was a really tiny screen that I've never seen before. Mm, okay, that anyway, was weird. If I go to my account, are you with me? Yeah, I click on my account in the upper right corner, and you should see your profile. And under profile, you have settings. You have meetings, webinars, recordings, and they settings. Won't let me look. I don't get in. Well, we're, that's where we were before. I think you just wanted to know where I was before. So yes. I, very simple, I went to zoom.us, and then up in the corner was um, um, my account. You click on that, and then you're in. You're dropped into your profile, and under settings, uh, there are a couple of things you have to set here before you uh, open a meeting. Now here, but I, there are a couple of things you have to do here that you can't do in the meeting, and one of them is to give yourself the ability to set a co-host. So if you can see on the screen, I'm in settings under my profile. And so I just hit control F and then I type C O dash and that takes me to co-host. So that blue button has to be on. If it's but not I can't. I'm I'm unable to get to, to anything far past the 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 I, I can't I can't log in. It's oh okay. It's well maybe you're not logged in. Uh and yeah, I can't that, find co-host. Even even using Control F. Control F. C O dash. C O dash. Yeah, I just that's what I had. Mm, okay. And I don't um, find anything. 
Can okay. I just mm-hmm. can I just read down um, in in meeting basic? Can, meeting can basic. I read down yeah. what I have? Okay. Um, I have the first one is require encryption. I don't think that's anything I know about. Okay, meeting basic. Yes, require encryption. I can see it there. I just typed okay. in basic. The second one is chat. Chat allow <laughs> participants to send messages. Mm-hmm. Private chat that lets people talk with you. Yeah, uh, auto saving chat. Yes. Play sound, file transfer. Play Is sound when participants good? join or leave. I like that one. I, I need that one. Okay, heard by. Oh hope. no, you don't want that one. Heard by. Oh, hope. you don't want that one. I was I was in a a Google oh. Meet last uh-huh. night that had that, and all the participants were screaming in the chat room. Turn uh-huh. off the chimes. Turn off. Oh, the chimes. Okay. It was so, okay, stuff. I'll turn it off because I think actually the one I'm looking for is when someone comes into the waiting room. When participants join. Yeah, but don't room. you see it? I, I see it because it comes right into the middle of the screen or close to that. Okay. I, if it's not a lot of people, I think it would be fine. The problem is we had two, almost 200 people in this meeting last night and they were constantly coming and going. Okay, yeah. So, um, it was awful. It was so distracting. Okay, I've scrolled down and co-host is there in that list. It's about the tenths down. All right, I'm, I'm going and I, I, I want to, I mean, I don't think that I could have looked for it so many times and not seen it. Mm-hmm. So I just want to go use down. So play control sound, and... file transfer, feedback to Zoom, display end of meeting experience. Uh-huh. And then your next one has to do with co-host. Yeah. Right? But that mine one. says... Mine isn't there. It says always show meeting control toolbar ah, after display. You don't have co-host or so are you? I a, don't have co-host. Are you a paid Why user not? or a free user? Free. Okay, maybe that's it. Maybe that's the. Maybe it's a. I'm a pro user, so. Mm-hmm. I I think it could be something like that. Yeah, that's probably. Right. Let Let me, let me ask price. different prices. Okay. Can. The other important thing here is screen sharing. Uh, you have to set it to host only. If you give participants the right to screen share, then um, you um, you could lose control in the case of bombers. So that's one of their tools. They, they'll share the screen. Uh, they can share nasty stuff on the screen. Uh, you, you can share a screen yourself and that will override, as a host, you can share a screen yourself and that will override their screen share. But yeah. still, it's done. So uh, if you want people to share the screen, you have to start the meeting with this setting and then you can give them the right to share a screen as you go. Um, right, I, I found an article in Zoom support, which I'm just sharing with you mm-hmm. as, as I look at it. Okay. I think I it doesn't seem to immediately say that you need to have a pro account. Yeah, I, I really don't know. You know, actually though- No, so I can just, look at this later, but, yeah. but I just wanted to share with you that I wasn't able to follow those directions yeah. because I mm-hmm. couldn't find what I saw in the screenshot. Yeah, let's make that the lesson for tonight because um, I- You have to go ahead. I, uh, you ready? Yes, because we, we need to eat, and um, yes, yeah. it's 9 o'clock here, so. Um, yeah. what, what I would have liked to talk about, if we had more time, and perhaps we can do it another time, mm-hmm. I've, I've noticed that Facebook has just added a create a room. Mm-hmm. Um, uh-huh. A Zoom room? Well, it's, it's in Facebook. Okay. Well, in and I thought it would be fun to try that out and see how it mm-hmm. works. Like, I want to know: Are you creating a room that's going to be there all the time, like a Google Hangout? Um, or are you? I mean, do you somehow have to get people to agree that they're going to be in this room at a certain time, like with Zoom? So I don't know. I haven't tried it, but that's one thing. And the other thing is, I, I was in Google Meet. Um, mm-hmm last night for the first time, as I mentioned, and I found mm-hmm. it rather clunky mm-hmm. compared to Zoom, but it is free and, ah. and uses bigger, I mean, you can go over 100. With, with Zoom, with a free account, you can't go over 100 people. Uh-huh. 
which uh, you know, and you get a one hour a one hour limit in in Zoom meet. But but I thought we could experiment with that, and I think oh, yeah. the, the URL is um, meet.google.com. I think uh, this this next guy who's going to talk on the twentieth, yeah. Dilip Barad. I met him uh, in India at a conference there. He's a really nice guy. And he's been doing online courses. But the last one he did, or this, he, he invited me to, uh, to one of his, well, he invited his Facebook friends, basically, to one of his sessions. And this is what he did. He was giving a, basically having his class. He has hundreds of people in his class. And he was having them come together in, uh, uh, in this Zoom, uh, sorry, in a Facebook presentation room. And it was very effective. And he's talking. So you could, if you come to that in a, a couple of days, two days from now, let's see, what time is that? That's at uh, uh, 1400. So a uh, few minutes from now, half an hour from now. So anyway, uh, you can ask him. And I, I intend to ask him too. I'm quite curious how he did. I thought it was very effective. I just uh, dropped in on a session. I don't know if you can, if you went to his um, uh, Facebook page, uh, I did it, Barad. Uh, if you you might find on his page a uh, recording of this uh, this session, it was quite interesting to watch how he had set it up and was managing it. With all his students were basically giving presentations. Okay. But anyway, Nina, we, we really have to go. And okay. Sue, it's really nice to see you. I'm just trying to open my Thank Facebook you. page and it Thank won't you open. Thank you for today. I'll, yeah. I'll show you. An ongoing time. experiment. It was nice to see you. It was a nice surprise. <laughs> Sorry, yeah. I didn't happen to turn my computer on earlier. Uh, oh. No problem. It's good to no see problem. you. And really, you oh, know, we could... Wait oh. just a second, Vance. I, I want to grab those. Um, I want to save the chat. Okay. Okay. So, right click on, yeah, right click on it. Select all. Um, copy. <laughs> um, you can just go down to the three dots to yes. the right of That's everyone right. And, and click save chat. Okay, yes. yeah, sure. another way to do it. I will leave you. Goodbye, and uh, see you next time. Nice to see you, Suze. Bye-bye. Okay, well, I guess bye -bye. next next Sunday at noon, and hopefully we won't have any problems. Seems to be working just fine. So, and we'll talk I'm not talk sure then. I'll be there this Sunday, Sunday, but we'll see. Okay, well, if you want another time, let us know. And no, yes. I, I'll jump in and out when I can. <laughs> okay. You're, you're more <laughs> than welcome. Weekend. You're more than welcome. So I, I don't know. I really don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, I oh, would know, except I, I've got this schedule, that <laughs> which is really great. It's nice to yes. see everybody. Yeah, good to see you too. I'm off to do my Tai Chi, which I was going to do 40 minutes ago. Okay. Yes. Well, anyway. And I just happened to turn on my computer. Wonderful. <laughs> Wonderful. I'm yeah. eating. It is a spontaneous one we were putting on today. So May 18th, 2020. Uh, Learning together, actually, this mm -hmm. learning together event happened yesterday. It's, I think, 463 or something like that. Learning together, 463rd episode, and the eighth. So, this is the meeting. continuation. Hmm? This is the continuation of that. Yeah, I'll, I'll just take, I've already blogged it. I'll just take this video from where you came and uh, I'll uh, put that up and let people see it. Okay. Goodbye. Thanks a lot. Okay, bye bye.